We begin at 11 with a suspicious death in New Hampshire. Detectives inside a home where a man was found dead and police have arrested a juvenile. All of this happening in the small town of Antrim, which is west of Manchester. Good evening to you. I'm David Wade. And I'm Lisa Hughes. The man's body was found in a home that was on fire. Julie McDonald is in New Hampshire tonight at what is still a very active scene. Well, clearly a very involved investigation here. Many hours after emergency crews responded to a 911 call, tonight there are still lots of questions about the man found dead here and how a young person may have been involved. What started as a house fire at this Antrim, New Hampshire property remained a crime scene all day and night Friday. Yellow tape blocked off 5 Greg Lake Road as police and fire investigators carefully collected evidence. The flash of a camera could be seen in what appears to be an upstairs bedroom. Outside, investigators shined flashlights and walked with a police dog throughout the yard. Respond to 5 Brick Lake Road for a structure fire. Also have a male subject there, unresponsive. It was the middle of the night Friday, just before 3 a.m., when firefighters rushed here. Fire Chief Marshall Gale told the Monadnock Ledger transcript a woman and child were outside and said there was still someone in there. 41 year old Jason Beam was found dead. The chief said there were clear signs of trauma. Then about 12 hours later, the Attorney General's office said a juvenile had been arrested in connection to that death. Investigators wouldn't say anything more about the arrest or how that suspect is related to Beam. An autopsy is scheduled for tomorrow. Stay with WBZ on the air and on CBSBoston.com as we learn more about this investigation. In Antrim, New Hampshire, Julie McDonald, WBZ News.